Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. This is Joe Hendy, the Android Authority App Guy. After the intro, we'll show you some of the best PC to Android streaming apps for Android. First on our list is Two Player. Do note that the graphical issues here are actually an issue with the app and not a result of our screen capture method. It doesn't happen with all devices and it doesn't affect video playback. Other than the graphic issues, the app works pretty well. It recognizes DNLA servers and that's what we use to test the application. It recognized my Plex server and it was able to play videos from there. Since that is a big requirement for being on the list, that was good news for Two Player. It's a simple app and doesn't have a lot of features, but it more or less works. Mobile UPnP is a pretty popular PC to Android streaming app and there's a reason for that, because it works. Not only does it work on tablets and phones, but there is also a Google TV app that works pretty well too. The only real bad part is that the free version is a little crippled. During testing, we had no problem getting videos to play from the old Plex server, which is what I use for my DNLA server. It does require a secondary player like Mobile Player or MX Player to play the videos, but these are free, so it's no big deal. Next on our list is Emit. It's a very nice app that looks pretty good and works pretty well. Unlike some of the others on this list, Emit does not work very well with DNLA servers. Instead, relying on its own PC app to stream media to your Android device. You can add servers via IP address or PIN as required, but for newbies and people who don't know a whole lot about servers, this may be beyond their expertise. The app does work well, but for the best results, you'll have to get the PC app that goes with it. Plex is kind of the Pandora radio of PC to Android streaming. It features a solid and easy to use interface, and it's among the most popular streaming apps for any operating system. It's also packed tight with features, and Plex servers are DNLA compliant and can be seen by other PC to Android streaming apps. Like Emit, you have to get Plex's proprietary app to get Plex to work. Thankfully, Plex servers are pretty easy to set up, so this isn't a big deal. Once it's set up, videos stream pretty well with only the occasional hiccup. You can get it for tablets, phones, and Google TV. While Tonido can stream video for Android devices from the PC, that is actually not the point of the app. It's meant as a file sharing app between your PC and Android, so you can also share documents, music, video, and pictures. So if you want something with more than one use, this could be it. Video streaming was pretty good, although like Emit and Plex, you have to download its proprietary app on the PC for it to work on your Android device. So if you employ a generic DNLA server, you'll want to look elsewhere as you cannot even get into the application until you sign into your Tenido account. If you take a look at our leaderboard, you can see how all these apps stack up against one another. Again, these are based on their Google Play Store ratings and there is no bias on our part. If you want to try one of these apps out, the links are in the video description. Computer to Android video streaming is a pretty niche market, but there are still a fair amount of honorable mentions. These include Avia, Tversity, and Media House UPnP. PC to Android streaming is one of the rare markets where app performance matters more than how it looks. For most, finding an app capable of streaming stable and quality video is simply more important. Of course, because this is a niche market, there may have been a hidden gem that we missed. If your favorite PC to Android streaming app isn't on here, feel free to leave a comment and let us know. Once once again, I'm Joe Hendy, the Android Authority App Guy. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our social media links in the video description.